Hey everyone, and welcome to a quick but hopefully useful tutorial on how to animate images in Final Cut Pro. Now, this is something that you can use to just make your videos more interesting or make them a bit more professional, <laughs> unless you're me. It's a very useful skill that I learned really late down the line, not because it was difficult, but because I just didn't know where to start, and it's actually quite simple. So, uh, just a warning, coming into this, this requires you have some knowledge of uh, cropping functions, the transform function, other things like that. If you watch any, you know, how-to basic Final Cut video and then come to this one, you should be okay. To start off, we have our images, uh, they're already PNGs, of dolphins. So, here's our clip of an underwater sun ray thing. So um, we're going to drag the dolphin, our first dolphin, right here um, <laughs> on top of the water. So as you can see, it's just an image. But this can change using a special feature called animation. So if we click on this, which is the transform function, uh, this is where you'll you know make the image move its angle or, you know, um, change its size or whatnot. This is a very useful tool. What most people don't realize is that right up here is a little section which is so small yet so important. And uh, this is the animation section. So what we're going to do, first of all, before you do anything, you want to bring your image just in transform to where you want your picture to start. Now, first off, we want it to be a bit smaller since we're going to have two dolphins, and we're going to want it at a bit of an angle swimming because I don't think dolphins swim that way. I'm not sure. Um, and then we're going to want to drag it off because we're, we're, what we want in this case is to have the dra uh, the dolphins, <laughs> almost said dragons, the dolphins swim by the screen. So now the dolphin's completely off. Make sure to always have a bit of this um, a sort of the outline of the image available to you, because if you bring it off screen, you can't animate it because you can't get to it and move it around. So always have a little bit like this. Um, now what we're going to do is we're going to press this button up here. Now this begins the animation process. And essentially, what you want to do is, all right, let's just say we want the dolphin to move across the, the screen. So we're just going to take our slider down to here, and then animate the picture to move over here. And you know it's working if you have that red line there, like that. So that red line. Um, here we go. So now the dolphin should swim across the screen during that time. All right, great. So that worked flawlessly. Um, now the final thing we want to do for this dolphin is not only have it swim across the screen, but also have it do a flip. So what we're, and so what we're going to do is we're going to use our knowledge of the transform function to have it go from here. It'll swim straight, but then at this point we want it to spin around. And notice the angle, the rotations there up at the top and then come through here. And you'll notice those points up there have been marked with each thing we've done. So I, this should work now. <laughs> so it kind of spun on there. There you go. Um, now we have the second dolphin. And essentially we're going to do pretty much the same thing, but we're going to have this dolphin uh, come in from the top and rotate in the uh, and swim in the other direction. So we want the dolphin to come from the top, so we're going to change its angle. Again, this is the prep for the animation. And there we go. We'll, we'll have it go to the end, but just about. And um, hit the transform button, and now we hit animate. So we want the dolphin to rise up here. want him to rise up oops 
sorry, got ahead of myself there. We want him to rise up, and upon this one landing, we want him to spin this way, and then go off to the side. So we want him to spin up and go off to the side. And this should technically work now. And there we have it. We have our dolphins. So, I, <laughs> I hope that was somewhat educational to everyone, uh, although it does look a bit odd. And yeah, that's pretty much all there is to it. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment below. I will happily answer them. And have a good one, guys.